Ha, ha, ladies, what's poppin' or whatever? <laughs> hey, what's up, you guys? It's Queen Mani or whatever. And a special guest today is Baby Nahima. In today's video, we're actually going to be doing his three-month update video. I cannot believe I have a three-month-old already. Oh my gosh, it's so exciting and the slobber is so real. But yeah, let me do this kind of in a rush because he needs to eat. And he's going to get angry. Angry. <laughs> All right, let's see. So first things first, baby boy, his weight has definitely increased. Um... He's definitely heavy. He hasn't had a uh, third month checkup. It actually goes by every two months now. So he is going to get another checkup at four months. So I'll give you guys a correct weight once we have that update on his four month update. But I'm thinking the last time he was weighed was last month and he was 11 pounds. So I'm thinking he may be about a good solid 13, almost 14 pounds. This boy is heavy. He is getting really big. He's giving mommy, definitely giving mommy an arm workout. Um, so yeah, baby boy is chunky. The thighs are chunky, everything's chunky, and I'm loving it. Baby boy has officially grown out of size one diapers. I use Pamper Swaddlers and I really like them. Um, I received them as a gift at my baby shower and so far that's all I've been buying are Pamper Swaddlers. So I love those, but he is officially out of size ones because his chunky thighs can't take it and he is in size twos. Um, and I have a special announcement to make to you guys. I'm actually going to be doing my first giveaway ever. So it's so exciting. I'm actually going to be giving away almost over 480 Pamper Swallowers diapers in size ones. Um, they're boxed and everything. I haven't opened anything yet. So I was like, why not just give them away instead of letting them sit in the closet and give them to someone who really needs them. Bless you. Bless you, booty. So why not give them to somebody who needs them? Um, I would love to get back to my subscribers, so that's what I'm going to do. Um, I'm going to do a separate giveaway video with all the deets. So I'm going to link that in this description box down below. So you guys make sure you check that out to, you know, enter a chance to win over 480 Pampers Solders diapers in size ones. Because your chunky stuff just too fat to fit them. Um, I went to Carter's the other day, and I actually had to buy him a whole new wardrobe because this boy is just getting too chunky. Now he's in six month bottoms and he could fit some six month tops and he can fit of course three month outfits so now baby boy is eating up to six to eight ounce bottles per sitting so usually his biggest bottle would be the first morning bottle where he's been asleep all night and he's the hungriest when he first wakes up where are you going and you guys don't knock me i know i know this is kind of a no-no but he is starting to eat baby food we have slowly introduced baby food into his diet um he's eating baby carrots and baby bananas the puree kind in stage one um so he loves that will you move your um hands for this hmm? will you move your hands he loves his hands y'all so he might have a nervous breakdown about that look move your hands Move your hands, silly boy. Move your hands, chunky monkey. Come on. And then there's a little bit on his hands, so he's probably going to really like it. You like it? Or bananas we got a piece in your jaw chew it we're gonna try prunes ill for the first time the beech nut um prunes so uh yeah i don't like prunes it doesn't have a, a pleasant smell but i just bought it just to see and this is his first time tasting baby baby food like in a jar so oh my god i hate the smell but let's let's see You don't like it? You don't like it? Okay, you guys, we're back because baby boy is greedy. Another thing baby boy has been dealing with is teething. Um, if you guys don't know, babies can teethe as early 
uh, as early as two months, three months. So right now he is three months. He has been teething for at least two weeks now. He drools excessively. Um, that's one of the things that my mom started pulling, pointing out that he drools not just like normally but he drools a lot so like he can go he can wet up at least three bibs within you know a couple of hours so yeah he drools a lot uh secondly he likes to chew he chews his whole fist he puts his whole fist in his mouth and he chews it to the death um i don't see how he doesn't hurt himself but he chews his fist all the time he's always putting things towards his mouth now so he's grasping at toys he's putting them towards his mouth anything is going towards his mouth so um he's definitely teething right now Another indicator of teething could be that um, he gets warm sometimes, um, especially in the evenings. He is very, very fussy. Um, before he gets his last bottle and goes to sleep, he usually goes through through this kind of like fussy stage before he settles down. He likes to hold his bottles when he's not being lazy or tired. So right now he's in his lazy stage. Usually he'll like grip the bottle or he'll put both his um, hands around it and he'll try to hold it. So he likes to do that because he thinks he's grown. This boy, when I tell you, he talks nonstop. When he lays on his back or when we have him, he'll just sit there and he'll just scream. Um, I love that. Like, that's the limelight of my life right now is that he likes to scream. Now he's in this big screaming phase and talking phase. And if you sit there and talk to him, he'll just talk and chat it up. Hey, booty pants. Hello. Say, so I don't know if I like tummy time, but you need to like it because your head big and your neck needs to support that big old head. Yes, it do. Yes, it do. Yes! Roll over if you don't like it. Baby boy, he's almost rolling over. He rolled over a couple times um, by himself, but not too many times. He's trying to roll over. He's so fat, he just can't get that one leg from underneath him, but he is definitely trying to roll over when we put him on the bed. So now we have to be extra, extra caref careful if we're not directly, you know, supervising him. So we put a whole bunch of pillows around him while he's on the bed, and especially while he's napping, there's like always a mountain of pillows around him so he doesn't fall off the bed. Baby boy's sleeping patterns have been A1 since day one. Um, at three weeks old, I would say that, well, the first month was the hardest for us um, as far as no sleep, being tired all the time. It was really, really hard to just adjust to motherhood, parenthood, period, for me and my boyfriend. I would say after that first month, baby boy became um, a self-scheduler. He kind of went through his own routine. He's, um, he has his like set naps that he usually takes. So, um he's he's a good napper he he has pretty much a routine down packed and when he wants to go to sleep at night we have been getting a blessed eight hours of sleep a night so that is a beautiful thing ever since he was two months old we have been getting at least a full eight hours of sleep usually he'll head to bed around 11 um and he won't wake up till well usually between the hours of seven and nine is when he'll wake up so we literally get a full eight hours of sleep with him um, so he's a good, good sleeper and he wakes up in a very, very joyful mood. Usually, um, he'll wake up laughing or he'll just wake up to a smile on his face. And even sometimes, uh, in the middle of the night, like I'll peek over to see if he's awake in his bassinet and he'll just be sitting there just staring at me, just waiting on him to like, you know, waiting on me to say something, but I'll just like slowly lay down and go back to sleep. Um, last but not least, for one of his updates that I'm going to give you guys, he loves TV. He loves technology. And I know babies of this generation, that's like whatever like every baby loves technology now but he like is very attentive to my cell phone whenever i'm on it and like i put it in front of him he loves my cell phone because he knows i'm turning on netflix to watch his show pokoyo that is his favorite favorite show my mom actually introduced him to it so he loves pokoyo and i think it's because of the color color contrast the background is white and the characters that are on there are very very colorful so the color color con i cannot say that so the color contrast really helps with his um, keeping his attention. So he loves that show. He also loves Little Einsteins too, but Pokio is definitely his favorite for how young he is right now. And the color contrast helps a lot. So I think that's all the updates I have for you all for Baby Boy on his three month update. He has made it to three months. He's growing so fast. Like I. I swear I never believed when people say, oh, you know, love them now because they grow up really fast. But now I realize why parents say that because they do grow so freaking fast and they learn so many things like in such a little time. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, like, comment, and subscribe for more videos of this little cute fellow. And I also do vlogs, makeup, anything that you guys would like to see. I do that too. So remember to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel at Queen Money. Say bye, baby boy.
Bada bada bada. Bidi bidi bum bum. Bidi bidi bum bum. <laughs> Bye guys.